the magical feeling of match day and the desire to lose yourself in the moment. That's what today is all about. A meeting of two talented sides ready to go at it in front of a capacity crowd. Not to mention the eyes of the wider football world. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live from the Bernabeu here on EA TV. It's very much a temple of football, the Santiago Bernabeu, right here on the Spanish capital, Madrid. I'm Derek Ray at the microphone, and joining me for match commentary is Stuart Robson. And we've got so much to look forward to. This is where it all begins in Europe's Premier Club competition, the UEFA Champions League, the group stage, match day one action. It's Real Madrid up against Stuttgart. Well, thanks, Derek. This is such an important game. Both sides will be desperate to start this group well. Let's hope we see some great football today. Well, he really is danger personified, but in this game, Stuart, what do you think we might see from him? Well, we know he's a top-class player, but at set plays, that's where he's at his very best. And he's got so many techniques. He can hit through the back of the ball, he can wrap his foot round it, or just chip it over the wall. He'll certainly score goals if given the chance today. And the starting 11 for Real Madrid. Carvajal starts with Antonio Hudiga in central defence. Federico Valverde plays alongside Jude Bellingham in the centre of midfield. And handed the task of playing up front today is Kylian Mbappe. Mbappe! And a goal right off the bat. No wonder they're jumping for joy. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And when he gets onto it, he holds off the challenge, keeps his balance and makes good contact with the ball. That's a top-class finish. Well, just look at his reaction. That could prove to be a massive goal for his team. And back underway. 1-0 it is. Atakan Cavazor. The defenders know you can't really allow space like that. But the danger averted for now. Real might threaten on the flank. Who can he pick out? Birmingham! And not cleared away properly. Well, it comes to nothing in the end. Angelo Stiller. Denis Undav. And he's outdone himself. Wonderful save there. He's driven in the corner. And the goalkeeper really exuding confidence. Bellingham this might be ideal for the counter well that break looked so promising but nothing coming from it so plenty of forward momentum from Real Madrid here and a goal kick will be next want to see a shot oh that is a super save well he had to finish that but credit to the goalkeeper that's a brilliant stop who can he pick out and fist it away Vinicius Junior well how about that for a piece of tackling to break things up Maximilian Mittelstedt Chris Fury. And it's with Mittelstedt. Undav. Firing it towards goal. It's still alive. And a goal! Well, it looks easy when you can put them away like that. Well, here we can see it again. Normally, I'm the first to point the finger at a goalkeeper, but I think it's a good initial save. I'm not sure he could have done much more. Just a bit unfortunate, really, that it dropped to an opponent. 
Federico Valverde. And he could really get at the opposition. Can't miss, surely! And gobbled up with ease by the keeper. Bellingham. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. It's looking promising. Can they use it to their advantage? Chance to finish. And a goal to re-establish their advantage. Just look at the celebrations. Well, here it is again. And the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against. And then the finish is fairly simple in the end. That's a good goal. is here Jude Bellingham and making sure there was no danger in the end Valdemar Anton Atakan Karazor well, just one minute of time added on for stoppages here. And the first half is in the history books here at the Bernabeu. This man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Stuart. Well, Derek, he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout that first half. I thought he showed a lot of skill to get out of tight situations and he had a... Well, it is advantage Real after the first 45 minutes, but there's a long way from being settled. And a fine tackle. And Real's creative tendencies coming to the fore. Well, that's a really good authoritative tackle. Throw in here. Rodrigo. No, high quality defending. As ice for goal, and the keeper more than equal to it. Short corner taken. Valdemar Anton. Can they slot it home? Well, it came to nothing in the end. Rodrigo. Mbappe. On to Rodrigo. And he was in the right place to intercept. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Well, that'll be a free kick. Determined defending. Well, we're into the final half hour. Birmingham! Let's come off the keeper! Well, they survived the attack. Labelling. And Bellingham. It's there for him. Oh, he saved it well. And time for the change now. They favoured a short one here. This looks promising. And a goal it is for Real Madrid. They are on a victory course. Well, here you can see it again. It's a superb cross, just asking for someone to go and meet it. And then what a strike. That's hit with such ferocity. Certainly no stopping that. That's a great goal. Well, no wonder Ancelotti is delighted. They're bossing the game now. Now well, the action continues, and no shortage of goals. 3-1 as things stand. Girassi. And the pass deftly cut out.
Might really be able to trouble them here. And a big moment because the referee has pointed to the spot. Penalty coming up. And on the back of that decision, now it's a caution. Well, it's a tight call, but in the end, I think he's got it right. A penalty and a yellow card. This to get back into it. The keeper going in the right direction and saving it. Let's see about the delivery. And the danger still on. Pressure was high, and they could be in here. And a goal! He's doubled his total for the day in superb scoring form. Well, it's a very simple finish in the end, but his movement was really good. He just found himself a bit of space in the box when it mattered most. Well, the game has been restarted. 3-2 here. Aurelien Chouameni. And now Rodrigo. Rodrigo now he must favour the cross and thumped away intercepted effortlessly and the decision is one of offside here Vinicius Jr. Crossed accurately towards the far post. And a no-nonsense clearance. Well, it's not quite in the books yet, but almost for Real Madrid as they try to see it out. Stuart, what have you made of their overall performance? Well, their attacking play has been excellent today. However, by throwing so many players forward, they've looked vulnerable at the back, which is why this will be a nervy finish. They just need to hold on here. Straight forward for the keeper. Vinicius Junior. Vinicius Junior. That's a useful cross. Now they couldn't take advantage of the position they were in. The referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order. Now time is of some concern. Can they level matters? And he's made headway. And there is the full-time whistle. Real Madrid pick up all three points in this, their opening match in the Champions League. Yeah, it's so vital to get off to a quick start in these group stages. They'll be happy with the three points, but now they have to back it up in the next game. Six points and you're halfway there. Well, he put in a really thorough performance here, Stuart. Well, that was a great performance. His understanding of how to find space was brilliant today. And, of course, he scored two really good goals.